Since the beginning of 2021, the yield on the U.S. 10-year has risen from 0.9% to a current level around 1.57%. The consensus seems to be that the market is pricing in an explosive recovery in Q2 and Q3, plus the potential for coming inflation. Over the last seven weeks, however, yields have seemed to settle into a range between 1.5% and a high of 1.77%. The question is, are higher yields here to stay? The narrow trading range of the last seven weeks seems to reflect a fight between inflation and growth on one side of the equation versus a world full of negative yielding sovereign debt, including a German 10-year yield trading at negative 0.25%, coupled with a lingering belief that at any time the Federal Reserve could intervene quickly if the rate rise gets out of hand. From recent Federal Reserve rhetoric, it's reasonable to conclude that they are willing to allow for some inflation before they begin to raise rates. So unless the Fed pivots from this stance or the economic recovery faces new hurdles, it seems that higher 10-year yields should remain the new normal.